After a month of war in Ukraine, the need for support is only getting worse. And today, Catholics in SoCal are sending up a special prayer. CBS 2's Cara Finstrom is live in Hancock Park with more on an event that's happening later this morning. Cara, good morning. Good morning, Suzanne. That'll get underway at 9 this morning. We are in Hancock Park and here at Christ the King Church. There will be a special student mass, also a candle lighting ceremony. Local Catholic leaders say Pope Francis will be taking part in today's worldwide call for an end to the violence. In West Hollywood yesterday, another show of support for Ukraine. Take a look. This is the Abbey in West Hollywood where a silent auction and a fundraiser took place. There were Ukrainian flags as people gathered to show support. The monies raised are going to go towards humanitarian aid and the refugees. This comes as fighting enters its second month. Ukraine's president made a passionate plea yesterday to the world for people to mark this with a day of action. One refugee attending last night's event told us she woke up at 5 a.m. on February 24th to the sound of explosions. She shared photos of her four-year-old daughter and grandparents who hid in the basement for 10 days before a friend helped her and her daughter fly to the U.S. The rest of her family is still in Ukraine, including her daughter's father, who's helping fight the war. Her daughter's questions about him bring her to tears. I was shocked. I don't know how to explain this feeling. She always asked me to go home to see her father. It's hard. And President Joe Biden has announced new humanitarian aid for Ukraine as well. He is in the midst of meeting with European leaders. A number of summits taking place this week. And back here live, coming up in our next half hour, we'll be talking more about that. Just breaks your heart, Kara, seeing all of that video, but important to share. Mm -hmm. Thank you.